Diablo 2 Resurrected. This here is my first impression video, although I could already do a review. But I'm not gonna because this here is an angry rant. So where do I start? This here is not trolling, it's not a clickbait. It's the honest truth of my 24 hours. I'm not going to dump on the game itself because this here is and was still a masterpiece. First of all, servers are not at all prepared yet again. How many f times Blizzard can shit in the same pocket? I couldn't get into servers for an hour, which in modern days is unacceptable. Thousands of people can't get into servers even 48 hours after launch. PC gamers, for instance, but I don't care about them, I'm playing on PS5. But now, the, the icing on the cake. After 7 hours of game time, my evening concluded with an error message saying that my character had been reset to level 1 and I couldn't get into servers anymore. Sweet dreams, my sweet child! Enjoy the night with this knowledge and pray to God that this issue will be fixed. Luckily, it seems that PlayStation servers are running somewhat good now and I got my progression back. This was the first nag, the least of the problems I'm having with the game. The second issue, the most idiotic thing I've ever seen in gaming, online and offline characters are different. Yes, you heard me. What is this shit? What is the point of playing offline when you cut yourself out from everything else? And the worst of all, what is the point playing online when you can't use your character offline? It, it's beyond my mental capacity to figure out what was going on in the mind of those geniuses creating this resurrected release. I, I'll throw my hands up in the air. <laughs> I'm lost. It's retarded beyond belief. It totally ruins both experiences by dividing players. I don't... <laughs> I don't get it. How hard was it to have one character menu for both game modes? It's retarded. It's retarded. Blizzard? Blizzard is retarded. Diablo 2 is retarded. No wonder Activision is sued. I mean, no, no wonder. Maybe, you know, maybe the time they neglected for Diablo 2, they were busy raping other employees. So, I, I don't know. It kind of seems like it. And the last issue. Thirdly, and this one here is a doozy. Go up and crossplay. <laughs> Not only did they cut out any hope for the couch co-op mode, so I can't play with my girlfriend at the same time, but they totally ruined cross-platform co-op as well. Now get this, and it's going to make you laugh. So let's presume that you have PlayStation 5. You can't play with your friends who've bought PC or Xbox versions. Uh, <laughs> they need to have a PlayStation version. So the only way you can implement cross-platform is for them to buy PlayStation as well and to buy Diablo 2 for the second time for PlayStation and then load the character from BC game. Are you insane? I'm sorry for screaming. <laughs> I truly am sorry for screaming, but this here is horrible. Blizzard, Activision, what, what the hell? What the hell is wrong with you? What, 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 what are you doing? What? <laughs> I, I mean, are, are you out of your minds? Are, are you some sort of... Have you fallen on your head lately? Who, who is Mr. Activision and, uh, uh, and Mr. Blizzard man? What are you doing? Who, who are you? I mean, do you need help or something? Should I send someone over? I mean, those, <laughs> those were three mistakes that could have been easily avoided, but, but uh, they did the exact opposite. I mean, <laughs> they did the exact opposite. And those were my first impressions. Uh, my horrible 24 hours of discovering it all and I mean only because of that uh, the game will receive lower ranking definitely although otherwise the game is good and it should be at least uh, they didn't pull Warcraft Reforge with that one not completely anyways otherwise I mean the game is good but we already knew that everything else should have been like a clockwork like working properly fluidly but now it's like uh, Going in circles, like uh, getting uh, even even getting invites for my PlayStation friend to play with other PlayStation people. There are only two ways to connect to the server, and I, I mean, and I'm I'm not going to go deeper into the details, but it's like uh, uh, mixing uh, concrete with a tablespoon. It kind of feels like that. Anyways, this here was my first impression video for Diablo 2, and I'm sorry that you had to hear this.